Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome back to Lead Therapy and thank you so very much for taking time for tuning in to my video. Lately, with all the talk about the Second Amendment, I thought it'd be a good idea to make a video, what is the Second Amendment? Or the Second Amendment for dummies? Just to simplify it for those that don't know. The Second Amendment in the Bill of Rights guarantees gun rights for millions of Americans and has contributed to the United States becoming the most heavily armed population in the world. However, every state interprets the right to bear arms and a well-regulated militia differently. More recently, Congress passed the most significant gun control bill in 30 years that incentivizes states to enforce more red flag laws and expands background checks for gun owners between 18 and 21 years old. The legislation is a direct result from the Uvalde shooting in Texas. Although the Supreme Court has thrown out state gun regulations that they view as unconstitutional, like in the recent case in New York, where the court ruled six to three against a law that made it difficult to obtain a concealed carry handgun license. Nevertheless, the Second Amendment is at the center of the gun control debate and is blamed by Democratic politicians for the rise of mass shootings. What does the Second Amendment mean in simple terms? The original text of the Second Amendment in the Bill of Rights states a well-regulated militia being necessary to the security of a free state. The right of the people to keep and bear arms shall not be infringed. The text has been interpreted as the right for individuals to buy and protect themselves with guns. In 2008, the court reaffirmed that individuals may use the right for self-defense and for lawful purposes. The court also ruled state governments, like the federal government, may not infringe upon this right. What was the Second Amendment meant to protect against? Why was the Second Amendment created? In modern times, the common belief is that the Second Amendment was made to protect the right of citizens to hunt or to defend their homes from unlawful entry. While these are an example of the rights the Second Amendment protects, the historical purpose is broader. The historical purpose of the Second Amendment, according to constitutional scholars, was to give the citizenry of the newly formed nation the ability to fight against a tyrannical government and to defend itself against unlawful violence. This mindset comes from the framers of the Constitution. We had just defeated the British Empire and wanted to ensure a tyrannical government would be less likely in the future. And finally, who wrote the Second Amendment? James Madison, one of the founding fathers and framers of the Constitution, proposed the Second Amendment at the Constitutional Convention because he feared the government could use centralized military to oppress an unarmed citizenry. So there you have it. That's the Second Amendment for dummies. As always, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed the video, or if I gave you some information you didn't know, please take time to like, share, and subscribe, and hit those post notifications. And I will see you guys in the next video.